All right, let's start this vlog out with a little bit of positivity. How about that? Because the last one ended in just devastation. You know, kind of like when Nemo gets yanked out of the ocean in front of his dad. That kind of devastating. Are you doing this work to facilitate growth or to become famous? This week I started out with a 48 hour fast. As long as I make it till 7 p.m. tonight, I will have done it which is my longest fast ever, which is pretty sick. I might try to go until tomorrow, but I'm not sure yet. Yesterday I did a full body split, 40 minutes, 300 calories, pretty sweet. Nothing to be mad at except for my brutal facial expressions. Today I'm gonna do another full body split, but I have a feeling it's gonna be way harder because of sugar water, glycogen is getting sucked out of my muscles as we speak from just not eating anything. And then, you know, just while I'm talking about now, I'm probably gonna have a really light dinner. I'm just gonna have some turkey, rice, Greek yogurt, maybe an apple, just like I did last week. And yeah, I think that should be about it. The only problem with this 45, 46 hour fast is that I feel like I got nothing in the tank. Every rep is just struggle. I do I fucking get for eating two meals a day for three days in a row. All right, quick editor's note here. I just want to make it clear that crush the 48 hour fast. Made it to 49 hours, and all I had for dinner was turkey, rice, veg, Greek yogurt, and apple, some hot sauce. That's it. Nothing else. Literally nothing. One other piece of item of food entered my mouth. Okay, I lied. I'm also crushing a protein shake, and then a couple of these Pinty's chicken nuggets. Tash is smoking a pizza pop right now, which, in my humble opinion, is the lowest form of pizza you could ever sing to. Check this out, check this out, check this out. It's four o'clock, sun's almost setting. It's freezing. Canada, man. If we didn't have the world's greatest gay king to ever set foot on the fucking face of this planet, I would not want to live here. The moon's low key looking like a baddie tonight, though. All right, how we doing? It's Friday night. Had a crazy sick workout, chest workout this morning. Like an older, old school bodybuilding type workout that I haven't really done in a while. And it felt so good to just like isolate my chest. Yeah, I just haven't done it. I usually do a full body, so it was just nice just cranking out. Just like focusing on chest to jump triceps too. Just haven't done that type of workout in a while. I feel like my, the app I'm using is making me a worse lifter. But also it's crazy how beneficial it is to have a spotter with you. Like just like cranking out those like last tiny red fridge. <laughs> you don't want to do it. And then they just put their fucking little fingers there to like help you up. It's just so psychological. It's sick. Yeah, burn like 400 calories in an hour and a bit workout. Oh, good. Feels nice. Now I'm gonna crush a protein shake and then get some wings. Basically, I'm getting 100 million grams of the finest protein money can buy. Straight to the muscles. Okay, it's Monday. I haven't talked to you for a while. Let me let me take you through what happened the past couple of days. Saturday, woke up so grumpy. Didn't want to work out. Holy shit, did I ever not want to work out? 
So you're saying instead of working out, we should just golf the full time? <laughs> but it ended up kind of being nice. You know, circuits are fun. Circuits are fun with your friends. We did a five exercise circuit, kept it simple. Six rounds for two rounds. Two of the rounds you had to wear the weight vest, which, dude, I don't know if you ever tried to do pull ups with a weighted vest before, but it really, <laughs> really humbles you. Holy fuck, did I ever not want to do that? Yeah. <laughs> I woke up this morning and holy shit, that was fucking hard. That was a good one. Like Wearing the vest. Was that was good. How's was elite? That was a sick idea. Six rounds, two rounds each with the vest. Yeah. We got a fourth. We got to do eight. Yeah. And then after that, we kept it really nice and light for lunch. Went to, oh, you can eat sushi. And then we ordered more food later when we were chilling. So I failed. Two meals on Saturday. Devastating. Saturday night. Got more food after we ate, after we did all you can eat sushi. I feel like shit, so incredibly full. I feel like I'm gonna wake up tomorrow with a food hangover. I lose a disapproving face. Sunday, didn't do a single thing. I was so sore from Friday and Saturday's workout. I woke up with like a food hangover. Such a nightmare. But now it's Monday, back at it, just finished another workout. Did a pretty nice, nice chill pull workout. Um, got the muscles, got the muscles, got the juices and the muscles flowing. Back at it. I find like, I'm still really sore this morning in my glutes, but I, sometimes like the best way to deal with soreness is just to work out those muscles a little bit lighter. So like my glutes are really tight. So I just did some good mornings here, nice and light, but it gets the blood back on it and you just feel better feel better about it. My goal was to be 199 by next Friday, which is a week and a half away. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it. I really botched it these past two weekends, which is devastating. But you know, long-term vision. Just because I fucked these two weekends up, doesn't mean I, can come, I can't come back at it stronger, better. Less cliches. All right, you're in big time luck here. We are doing a once of a kind. Hey, I'm vlogging. We're doing a once in a lifetime Buble limited edition review. Mary Berry? Mary Berry Buble? Tash, Tash is watching on yonder. Smells good. Smells like cranberry. It's pretty good. Tastes like the other ones, basically. But merrier. But merrier. But merrier. Tastes like the other ones, but way merrier. I don't know. It's like a combination of berry and lime. Pretty delicious. Would recommend to a friend. This is what I'm eating tonight for dinner. Doing a little uh, chicken turkey bacon sandwich with a little bit of cheese, mayo, mustard. Simple easy. It's also on this like carb free bread. So it's like 40 calories a slice. So this whole sandwich is probably 400 cows, 350 cows, 20 grams of protein. Take it. And then um, I'm gonna crush a protein shake. That's Monday. Monday in the Vegas household. Should we just change our last name to Vegas? Down. Spooky coyotes, creepy man. We're just trying to go for a pleasant walk, you know? Now we got fucking coyotes stalking us. I live like 15 minutes away from here. Wild. All right, welcome to the last workout of the week. Last day of the vlog. Trying to do some heavy, heavy squats today, heavier. So I need to limber up. Holy fuck, holy note sucks. Um, 
yeah, you can do some squats and then like another full body, it's more full body split. Full body splits mostly every day. That's what I'm into right now, okay? Fuck. Then I'm gonna crush a meal. That's it. And I'll do a final weigh in. See what I'm waiting at. five or six probably could do way more honestly maybe more reps but just trying to get back into it but feeling pretty good feeling pretty good today i was uh i felt pretty solid dude just finished a sick workout those squats felt way better than i thought they were gonna feel that was pretty cool still still bitch weight though 20 40 pounds off of two plates need to get up there but I'm not really in a rush. I don't really care about lifting that heavy. My main goals are look good, feel good. And if I wanna get a heavy squats, I gotta do it slowly and I gotta make sure all my joints feel good. Whew. Yeah, I guess it was a full body, full body workout, but honestly, really quad, really leg heavy. And then shoulders, a little bit of triceps. That's about it, pretty good though. Okay, this is the end to another vlog. It's a pretty decent one. Final weigh-in was at 202.2. 202.2, which is crazy, because at one point earlier in the week, I think it was on Sunday, I weighed in at 208. But I didn't record it, because I was ashamed. <laughs> Completely ashamed. I'm basically doing the same dinner as I did last night. Sandwich, but I've added in a couple nuggies. I'm a creature of a habit, you know? The more I can eat the same dinner every night, the less I have to think about it. That's what I really like. I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. All right, you're welcome to the vlog. Oh my God, you're such an idiot. You're never going to be a vlogger. What the fuck, dude? Oh, I was in the shop. What happened to your ear? We cut it shaving. You wouldn't get it. <laughs> and then, yeah, that's it. Okay, bye.